back here at Wrigley on a gorgeous night. We get ready for Reds and Cubs game three of a four game set. Let's check out the Reds lineup. Newman, Senzel, and McClain, the top three. And they're up against uh, Drew Smiley, the Cubs pitcher tonight. Fastball, curveball, cutter for the veteran left hander. 4.50 ERA. This will be his third start against the Reds. First two did not go well. Line drive and a base hit out into left center field. Bellinger trying to cut it off. He does. Newman. Big turn and then skids to a stop. Throw back to first. And it's a single. Nick Senzel gets the start at third base. Senzel on a pitch right at the knees. Strikes out looking. Now it's Matt McClain. <coughs> Line drive center field. Bellinger charging. Makes the catch. Spencer Steer. Steer poked to left. Hap angling back. And that's gone. He poked it all right. That's his team leading 16th home run. A two out, two run shot. And the Reds take a 2 0 lead. And if you watch this swing from Spencer Steer, this is not an overswing. It's just a balanced get the barrel of the bat to the baseball, and he lifts it out of the ballpark. The batter down, Christian Encarnacion Strang. Outside corner, ring him up. Smiley gets the strikeout but gives up the homer. Williamson, rookie left hander, has got a five pitch mix. So a slider all that off. Landed backdoor strike three. Beautiful sequence from Williamson. And Morrell probably, it's a competition between him and Wisdom for the most free swinging of these potent Cubs. Good changeup. Ouch. Ouch. Back to back strikeouts for Williamson. Down and away from 0 2 to a walk. Swanson. Runner off, swing and miss. Three strikeouts and one walk. 0 oh 1 on Votto, hitting 205. Votto to center. Bellinger bending back. That's gone. Carry, that's gone. Votto drills it to deep center, right into the batter's eye. Couple of shots for the Reds early in the game. Votto's 10th of the campaign. It's 3 zip. Been a nice little road trip so far for one Joey Votto. We have seen him in second half <laughs> hotter than a match. Boy, wouldn't that nice be nice to see him get rolling. Cincinnati on top by three as we go to the bottom of the third, and Jamer Candelario steps into the batter's box. That one laced into the corner, and Candelario rips a double as if on cue. Patrick Wisdom, breaking ball, lifted. Steer settles and snares. Horner, who struck out looking his first time. Chip to right. Benson flying in. Full speed. Makes the grab. Fired a second. And wow. Candelario just got back. Made that close. Now Morell struck out swinging his first time. In the air, left field. Morell unloads. Oh! Hammers it out of here. And the Cubs within a run. For Christopher Morrell, that home run is number 17. It's 3-2. That is one of the deeper home runs we've seen hit near that scoreboard this season. One gone, seven in a row retired by Smiley. Christian Encarnacion Strand worked a full count, struck out looking his first time. That's a fair ball. That's a base hit. Half after it, Encarnacion Strand, a second to throw, and a second offline and late. Showing some legs, and Carnacion Strand doubles just inside of third base after a great plate appearance. It's this one right down the third baseline on a cutter. That cutter stayed on the plate. It was middle end, but just to keep it fair, that should tell you a little something about how the timing is for Encarnacion Strand. So Encarnacion Strand's at second base. Joey Votto's the batter. Votto a home run his first time up. Votto to deep right center. Good carry to the stands, gone! A two-homer day for JDV! Oh, Joey, Joey, Joey! Votto is getting hot! He has driven in three, and the Reds lead by three. And you can see the fans there surrounding the man who got the ball. Two Reds fans are begging, give me the ball, give me the ball, and everyone else wants him to throw it out of the field. That is a veteran hitter that pays attention. Swanson standing in. Dansby drives one in the air, deep left field. Get out the tape measure for Dansby. Long gone. All the way on to Waveland Avenue. And it's a five to three ball game. There are home runs, and then there are no doubt home runs. We've seen a couple of Muff Cubs bats today, Morrell. 
with a blast off the video board and left and now Swanson just to the foul pole side of the video board and this one way out of the ballpark on the Waveland Avenue. Men at first and second just one down and Christopher Morell do up. In the air out towards right center field going back Fairchild back some more. And it's rolling here comes Candelario. Horner racing for third and he's in. They had to wait and wait, and it ends up being a double off the wall. It's 5-4. That thing scraped the stars. We know that Morale is popping his bat, and this one just gets it up. It's outside. He has enough strength. It's the outfield off the wall. And then take a look, too, as he's running the bases, because the runners have to wait. They don't know if this ball is going to be caught. It's off the wall. Morale ends up on second. And that little roller right side, right at first, out at first. Oh boy, run scores were tied up five and five. It was close. You never know with Bellinger because of that speed. It's not hard off the bat, which it has been a lot recently, but you also know that he can get these infield singles. And this one as he hustles up the line, just out. Three, two. And Hat will take the walk. And now it's Jan Gomes 0 for 2. Well, there goes, line drive, fair ball, base hit. Head towards the corner. Here comes Hap. Willie's going to send him. Haps him to score. Gomes an RBI double. And the Cubs have a 6-5 lead. And that's just the way it's gone lately. J.D., this team's shown a lot of fight. Down, down early, doesn't matter. There he is. We'll see if Sayers can show some patience here. Swing and a line drive out towards left center. That'll touch down for a hit. Here's Gomes around third. Heading to the plate. The throw. And Suzuki with the RBI single. It's 7-5. Rolled through the right side, diving play, safe at first, infield single. How do you like that? Jamer Candelario with another infield hit. It's his third infield hit in two nights. Mike Tuckman, the pinch hitter. Line drive, that's a base hit. That's going to roll all the way out to the bullpen door. Nico's in to score, or I should say Say is in to score. Candelario in the third. It's an RBI double for Tuckman, and it's 8-5. Their latest pitcher is Mark Leiter Jr. Facing the pinch hitting T.J. Friedel. Driven in the air, deep right center. Tuckman back, and that is gone. The Reds had seen eight consecutive runs scored against them. They had eight consecutive hitters retired. And Friedel's eighth home run of the year gets one back for the Red Legs. It's a four-run game. In that instance, if you don't get to the split finger, that's not good. Bottom seven, and the Cubs up to hit. Here's Ian Happ. In the air, center field. Friedel back. Back some more. He'll turn it. He'll look. It's out of here. And Happ unloads. And the Cubs get the run right back. Number 11 for Happer. 11-6. Thing one he has, has hit as a right-handed batter this year. Last one, first one came in the last home stand against the Nationals. He lays into this one. And the pitch to Talkman. Line drive, base hit, right field. This will be extra bases. Talkman racing for second. And coming around to score is Candelario. It's 12-6. Ground ball to third. Senzel up with it. Tuckman in to score, and it's 13 6. Here's Morell now. Chop towards third. Off the glove of Senzel, rolls into left field. Tuckman around third, and Mike's coming in to score. It is all Cubs here tonight, 14 6. Luke Maley, we saw him just last night pitching. Here's a deep drive to left center. This is going to leave the yard. Home run, Ian Happ. His second of the game. He's feeling good from the right side. Make no mistake. Suzuki. High fly ball out towards left field on its way out of here. Home run says Suzuki is ninth. All Cubs 16-6. Top of the order at Fraley. This ought to do it. Horner to first ball game. Cubs win. An offensive explosion for the second straight night.